Hello and welcome back to Homesteading Northern Michigan. Today is really exciting for me. We got our hybrid inverter in the mail yesterday and I've been waiting to do this unboxing. This was our last big purchase on our solar. Um, so right now it's all little things like building up the battery bank, etc. Which I'm going lithium ion, I'm building my own 18650 power wall. That's a lot of stuff's happening with that real quick here. So. so if you haven't, hit that subscribe button, ring that notification bell, and you'll be updated on my future progress on my uh, going off grid. The way it's looking, I should be off grid by winter. So make sure you stay tuned and uh, enjoy the video, guys. I've been waiting a long time to see one of these in person, guys. Some cables in here. I didn't think that one through, did I? bracket pretty heavy duty that your gauge steel this thing weighs quite a bit by the way we have some anchors for the bracket we have some data transfer cables monitor cable I can't wait to hook this up and find out everything it's got look at that guys oh yeah that is a beast right there. This is comparable to the uh, the MPP Solar 5048 from the research that I've done. This is what the EA Sun Powers equivalent. Oh, Let's get this out of here. Now we're not going to be breaking into it and seeing how the hookups are, although I should. Oh. Bag out of here so we can see what we got here. Oh. There's screws in it to get to the wiring here. We have 120 volt input breakers down here this is this is nice this is big got a filter in it for the cooling fans back of it's just flat so no venting or anything like that back there all the ventings on the top here if we look if we look over here at the bottom of it we have our parallel collect connections that these are what all these cables go to this also came with software similar to the uh, batrium or batrium system so I can monitor all 14 um, all 14 packs I have in series from the power wall so that's that's interesting i like that a lot so i can from what i know i can run up to three of these in parallel 
so that would give me quite a bit that's way more than I need to run this should be what I need to run my house and my workshop if not I will put another one on this is a beautiful piece of equipment guys I can't wait to get it hooked up so make sure you hit that subscribe button oh we're gonna look we're gonna look inside here first I'm not doing that I'm not skimping out on you guys like that I'll be right back okay so going over this we do have a battery management program for the computer. I thought this was the one that hooked to your, uh, through a phone app or whatever that you can network through, but it's not apparently, but you can still monitor what's going on and that's all built into it also. So that's really nice, but you got your, your plugs from your, uh, your plugs. So you got your lugs for your, your uh, battery bank going in there. You got your two ports for your solar panels here to go in. So that's your input from your solar panels. And you got your AC input here. And that's gonna be because this is grid tied. So that means if my batteries fail or um, they go dead or anything like that below where I set it, the perimeters I set it over or under, it will shut down my battery system and convert automatically over to the AC. Um, and just give me a flag, give me an error for me to figure out or it'll tell me. I don't know. Well, I guess we'll figure that out when the time comes. But here's the AC output. Both of these are 120 volt. Um, it also has circuit breakers for each one. Um, I don't know exactly what everything else is here. These are for parallel yeah. These are for parallel connections. Uh, for sistering up two or three of these. I think three is the max on this system. This is the 5 kilowatt, 48 volt off-grid. No. Grid-tied inverter. So, it is a pure shine wave inverter and the NPPT maximum power point tracking um, charge controller. So um, this should run what I need it to run, but I may have to get another one. So I'll leave a link in the description to the guy I bought it from. Um, it was pretty quick shipping. Um, the price wasn't too bad. Uh, this comparable unit, like I said earlier in MPP Solar, this comparable unit is like $2,500, if I'm not mistaken, is what I was looking at. Um... So I paid 1480 I think it was, for this. So I got the link in the description. Um, and make sure you subscribe and like, comment, and uh, let me know what you think. This is the EA Sun Power 5 kilowatt, 80 amp, split phase, 230 volt hybrid inverter. Well, I'd like to thank you for watching Homestead in Northern Michigan. I'm really excited to start using my solar panels. It's been a long-term goal to uh, get some solar and go off-grid. And after years and years and years, finally it's coming true. So I'm thinking we're going to be off-grid by wintertime. So, uh, and the next video should be coming up real soon. Uh, I'm thinking it's going to be assembling a battery pack. Um, with the spot welder and all that stuff. So hit that subscribe button. Ring that notification bell so you can stay updated on my newest upcoming videos. And uh, have a blessed day guys. Peace.